Ever heard of aphasia and wondered what it is? Today, we're unraveling this often misunderstood yet incredibly important topic. Aphasia is a language disorder that impedes communication, usually stemming from brain damage due to a stroke, traumatic injury, or other neurological conditions. It's not just a medical term tucked away in textbooks. Aphasia is a life-altering condition that impacts everyday communication and interaction, transforming the lives of those it touches in ways you might not imagine. Aphasia is not one size fits all. There are different types, each with its own set of challenges. Expressive aphasia, for instance, can make it tough to articulate thoughts through speech or writing. On the other hand, receptive aphasia can cloud comprehension of spoken or written language. Some people may even experience a mix of both. It's like trying to listen to a radio with poor reception or speaking through a microphone with a faulty wire. Knowing the type of aphasia can help tailor the right support and treatment, making a world of difference to those affected. Living with aphasia can be tough, but it's not a dead-end road. The gravity of aphasia extends beyond language, seeping into daily life, social interactions, relationships, and even employment. It can be an isolating experience both for those with aphasia and their loved ones. Yet, hope persists. Thanks to available treatments and rehabilitation techniques, including speech and cognitive therapy, individuals can manage aphasia effectively. These methods, tailored to suit individual needs, aim to enhance communication skills. With appropriate treatment and support, individuals with aphasia can navigate their challenges and improve their communication skills. Aphasia, a complex language disorder, can significantly impact a person's life. We've covered the basics today. It's a communication disorder caused by brain damage, often from stroke or injury, with various types and symptoms. It can affect daily life, including social interactions and employment. But with treatments like speech and cognitive therapy, we can help manage aphasia and improve communication. Thanks for joining us in understanding aphasia better. Don't forget to subscribe for more insights into neurological conditions. See you next time.